we are sticking with the relaxation vibe here in Rio. After the yoga, we're doing some puzzle. Sorry, guys. Totally accidental. And I have some of the best puzzle makers in the business. I have Vitality with me, Apex, Dupree, and Zaiwu. And even before we started going live with the camera, Apex briefed us on how we were supposed to do this. So Apex, I'm going to give you the mic. You have to tell us what, were the, what was the strategy. Okay, so I used to do that with my mom when I was a kid. It was 20 years ago, and I have a good memory, so I remember how to do that. Uh, first, you put the sides on the side. <laughs> uh, so that's what we did. And then colors by colors. So we already did that job before starting, because we have only 20 minutes, and we're not sure we will finish. So you're planning to finish it before we're done here? Oh, yeah, we, have we, have yeah, we have to. In oh, we fact, have to. we cannot leave the building until it's over. Yeah, that's why we need to work on. <laughs> okay, I have a side here. <laughs> <laughs> I put the side all together all already. Okay. So thank you, uh, Peter. No, but you, what, the f what do you mean? You lack an No, this, no, this, oh, this was already done. Yeah. We, we had a little bit of a head start ah, so that wait, we can wait, actually wait, 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 wait. They said that together. was the hardest part. So if we actually just find like the side parts. That's we, really I did. Now. That's what I did. <laughs> no, you did. Ah, you did. Ah, guys, I found them. I found them all. Look, look at the That's why they actually need a leader. They need you. <laughs> I'm just going to relax over here and let you guys uh, do the business, having a good time. It's, it's, okay, okay, fish. Fish. it's okay, fish. It's okay, fish. I love uh, fish. So we need to find something? No, you just do things. Okay. The, need reason why, the reason why we're doing yeah. this, this puzzle, right? It's we're having this idea of no, it's, it's a missing piece, like a player joining a team. That's, that's the <laughs> okay. metaphor we're going for here. Mm -hmm. okay. um, that's the main team. And I just wanted to ask you guys if, from your perspective, if we, from the outside, if we don't make too much of a big deal out of one player joining a team. Do you really feel like there's one player joining and it makes such a big difference? You just had Sphinx coming in. Mm -hmm. I mean, is it, yes, I think so. is it the piece that completes the puzzle? I mean, is that what's happening? I think you can see also with Astralis when Magis John, I mean, they won Kanda everything after mm -hmm. that. So it was kind of the piece when I mean, of Astralis missed, then I yeah. think they won everything after that. So sometimes just only one player can do everything because of look his look mentality, me. of mm. his mood also. <laughs> <laughs> so I think, yeah, sometimes it can be good. How did it feel for you? you, you he mentions Majisk joining Astralis and then that clicks. You were obviously yeah. leaving that moment. Yeah. Uh, I think uh, I've talked about it before, but I, I, I really do believe that f fixing role issues within a team is probably the, the main criteria for a team to succeed. Um, we kind of also had the, the same thing with the uh, with the old edition of uh, of our vitality when we had Misuda, because uh, me and Misuda wanted to play the same things, we wanted yeah. to do the same things, and you will, if you have two players that want to do map control or do the same things, you will always end up having one guy that is not feeling comfortable playing, and I think that is one of the main like no it basically means you have 20% of the team not functioning the way it should, mm -hmm. and that's a pretty big deal. So I I really believe that finding a player that is that is feeling comfortable playing the position that that someone else does not like. Okay. And having like the lurker, like you, you have the role set in stone. I think that is a really big key to, to get things to work. And uh, yeah, that is that's that is simply what worked for us in Australia. We got a uh, message. Sorry, guys, we missed one side. I think that is I what like, kind of happened with the Australia back in the days. Okay. We got matches back into the like, we we Well, not back in the team, but we uh, got him into the team and everything just started clicking. We had everything up. working for us. So, uh, Do you yeah. think or do you feel? Like something similar is happening now with Sphinx joining you guys. Does it feel like some of these roles clicked? I I, I really believe that we've uh, we found a, a a combination of players that works really well together, both obviously inside the game but mm -hmm. also outside the game, which is is also really really important. Uh, the roles are a lot more fixed now, and we feel we feel comfortable doing our things. And now yeah. it's more about. Yeah, adjusting and, and figuring out how we can use each individual player to their full potential. And that is what takes time. You okay. know, I'm I've also I also feel like it takes time to build build like a team to to compete for titles. You always have the honeymoon where you will be able to maybe play a little bit above your your, your level because everyone is feeling good and everyone is enjoying their time. But in 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 the long run, you need to be able to have like a, a full uh, a map pool that works for you, but also a playbook that works for you, and that will take maybe okay. between four and six months to okay. actually get f to get uh, function the way it should be. So yeah, and so I nice. personally I, I agree with you. I know things can take time mm -hmm. to work in full effect, but we have a couple of examples I think in recent history in Counter Strike where like a player joins and it's almost immediate success. Yeah, like. Let's say Robson phase. Yeah. First example comes to mind. Yeah. It seems like your Kinder to Liquid is a bump 
or a buff for them yeah. immediately. At least something that has helped them tremendously. What, yeah. what do you think, or how could we explain to the people at home what's happening in these moments? Why sometimes it's an insta-click and sometimes it takes a bit more time to have that impact? I think the craziest part is like for, for Rob's joining FaZe, because FaZe last year, I don't know, they didn't feel a, a threat at all. Okay. They were like... Like to play against the world. Yeah, yeah. Mm. they were like, I think they did one playoff in the world year, even though we had uh, half online and half offline. It was uh, ESL Cologne. So I think that uh, it was really tough for them because they had um, a lot for quite some time and it felt like it didn't work and that was kind of the end for him, for his career. Mm -hmm. And yeah, when they added um, Robs, they instantly like got. Good, I, really I felt good. like everyone understood that now they have the lineup. To go through and no, it's not possible. <laughs> 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 I was almost and, um, <laughs> and yeah, it just clicked so <laughs> fast for them. And it, it, it's a bit the same example than Australia's had as well. Okay. I think when Magic joined, they did one quarterfinal, was in a blast, a uh, blast with a uh, star ladder, and then they won at Remark Marseille or something like that, from what I remember. Mm -hmm. And it's exactly like yeah, they just everything got like so easy in two seconds. Mm -hmm. Also like, also, like mentally, as you said. Like yeah, exactly. It's like everyone you trust. believes, everyone trusts that everyone is going to do their best. Yeah. And, and okay. that, that breaks confidence and yeah. everything. How much, how much of that do you think is... Um, it, it's not a trick question, it's, it's something I really wonder. Mm -hmm. How much of that do you think is placebo effect and how much of that is actually this new player coming in the team really making a change? I feel like sometimes as a player, at least for me when I was there, if thinking that mm -hmm. you have the good formula <coughs> might just be enough for you to suddenly give more, do more, try more, or is that, could that so. be a thing? I think so. Sure. I think yeah. having the right player, you're like, you know that um, you can play your style and you can do whatever the team needs without thinking of the consequences. Okay. Just you're like, okay, makes sense to do this. Anyway, if I die, my team has back me, can back me up. and. I think it's really important as well to just trust, trust everyone. I'm sorry, uh, it's not the, the no, one. No, I'm trying. Uh, don't worry, keep your I'm conversation. Sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. sure they're going to make a nice <laughs> little mix of me trying yeah, things yeah. that's not working. <laughs> it's definitely going to happen. Well, I'm that's fine a lot, with that. There's a lot of things like also to what you said then. Where like in, in terms of, you also know like if you uh, if you have a bad game, you have four other teammates that are capable of, you know, carrying you a little bit. Mm -hmm. So you're not like having to rely only on maybe one or two individual persons all the time, but you know that yeah. I can have bad games or I can mess up and I can maybe not do the things that is that, that is needed of me right now. But, yeah. but the rest of the good guys to, to feel do. like you have teammates behind you. Exactly. And just yes, and feel like, just okay. Just trust them. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you found it nice. You play a different game, I was playing like, ah, oh, that's for the end. I mean, imagine if I actually hit that. I thought you would actually hit uh, it immediately. We yeah. finished the side. Yeah. Okay. You're welcome. I'm done. <laughs> That's it. That was your. That was my uh, task. Your yep. one contribution. I mean, <laughs> we have the sides. Yeah, we yeah. finished something at least. Um, I have a small piece there. I was. I, we, th there was a, a question that we we actually talked about on the desk one of these times about confidence, and I wanted to to have your opinion about it. We sometimes we use a player's pedigree to say, hey, let's say Apex, he's won a major. Hey, Dupree, he's won many majors. Surely this guy has confidence. Surely he knows what's happening, and I. I would like to know from you how much of it you think is actually true that you build a resource of confidence and how much of it is actually just today, like how you feel today. Or yeah. is there really what something you that, you, that you build that's I in think, you? I really think it's important for any player that won in the past to, okay, you need to use this confidence as, um, as something, but it doesn't have to be always in your head like, okay, I'm going to feel good because I won before. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think you, in your head you, have to, you always have to learn more and just get better all the time. And that's why CS nowadays is really tough and that some players are falling. And it's just because it's not like it used to be uh, five years ago. Now, if you don't work, mm. if you don't try to get your best, if you don't think CS, if you don't, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. So that's the, the, the hard thing about CS. And then <coughs> the confidence, it's the same. Yeah. I think you can have confidence from winning tournaments and. I will have confidence going into a, 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 an arena because mm -hmm. I get used to it. I have no problem. I play on an arena for four years. But for the individual level, it's just the work you put every day that gives you this. Okay. And uh, yeah. the confidence you have in your team and all this kind of stuff. It's not about like 
winning, I think, four majors or okay. like 20 tournaments in your career. I don't think it's changed anything about like the confidence at the X moment. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you, you talk about how much work you put in, how much practice you put in, and that helps you build your confidence. Yes. Is that, you think that's something that maybe we underrate from the outside? Because what people do from the outside is the basic stuff. They open the stats page. They say, oh, there's a player here. He's struggling for the last whatever, a month, three months, six months. Yeah. Are we missing something? Are we missing a piece of the picture? You miss, I think when, when I hear um, like the analysts talking about that, I think there are a few things that uh, are misses for sure. Mm -hmm. The first one is um, obviously some players are <coughs> not uh, playing that well at some point, but why? Mm -hmm. Just why? Why is uh, is uh, his role fits to him? Is uh, this position fits? Does he fit good in the team? There's like can be a lot of mess in one team, and I lived that for for some time as well when I was a bit younger. So it's just about thinking what's going on into the team at the X moment, and I think that we underestimate that a lot, okay. and also the mental parts, like about you know sometimes one player doesn't fit into the team and. You're not really confident about your plays, and I know that Mathieu, for example, when he full right now, he feels confident about the team, and he's not the same than the first six months. Maybe you need to tell and people that Mathieu that is Saibu. Yes, I will, sorry. <laughs> and it's not only about <laughs> Matu. They should know his name. Matu is me. I think they probably. You imagine in football, you say Lionel. You know it's Messi. You know. No. Yeah, of course you do. I mean, not you. <laughs> no. but you know Peter but too. Yeah, no. I think that yes, since um, <laughs> Spinks joined the team, I think Zaiwu got much better. Okay. And it's also because he trusts more the team around. And it's not be because Mizuta was a bad player. It's not about that. But mm -hmm. he knows now we have a lurker. And he knows that also, I think firepower-wise, uh, Lotan is better than Mizuta. So it's all about that sometimes. And it's it's also can be a part of si also for me to call better because I feel better with uh, the system we have. I, I just trust more. Uh, for example, uh, I, wi I will just... Uh, really well, Lotan when he's lurking. Then, for example, when Mizuta yeah, was lurking, he's losing his role. Spinks. Or Spinks, yeah. <laughs> don't worry, Dup Dupree is here. Don't worry, he's gonna make sure that. And or, we know or about also when people. Peter, <laughs> <laughs> when Dupree was That's also. Me. <laughs> Hello, everyone knows <laughs> who I am. <laughs> it's also when Dupree was on the side. Of course, I trust more Lotan not playing lurking than than Dupree. So it can be a lot of like mental okay. aspect that can help you both as a player, as a captain, as everything to to trust the team around you. Okay, and it's something that's. People underestimate, I guess. And and you, um, Mathieu or Saiwa, I should say now, since we have to call people by the nickname. That's good. Yeah, thank you. Guys. What your um, Apex says, you feel more confident since Spinks joined. How do, how did you experience I, that I on your own level? Well. I mean, what, is, what did that change for you? Uh, just like I can trust everyone. It's not oh, only no. because uh, Lot and John. I mean Spinks. Just like I can feel. <laughs> Whatever I can do in the game, if I die, we are 4v5, I can trust the team. I mean, I, I'm, I'm not scared to die. Okay. I'm not like, I, I just can play my game. And just, and just that, fe that just did fe this feeling, it's so good when you play. Because, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of a people that I don't care, kind of. And okay. it's, <laughs> yeah. And <laughs> it's kind of when uh, Spring John, my freedom uh, was more like, you. I mean, I can, uh, it was more like benefit for me, and since it's done, uh, I can feel like I'm, I uh, enjoy more to play. Okay. Yeah, it's it's really good feeling. You say you 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 don't care. Are you are you sometimes under pressure? Do you feel sometimes nervous, stressed in the game? Because from, from the outside, it feels like it's not the case. But uh, now we have an opportunity to. Uh, actually, when I uh, when I'm in, inside of the server. Actually not. Okay. Uh, I'm just playing my game like it's can I face it or I mean can I like I say in, in, in every interviews like this game I play like it was my hobby at the beginning. That is oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this, this game was kinda my hobby when I start so okay. I have no pressure because uh, this is what I like to, to do and what I like to play. So I have no, no pressure. Of course when I this is important world or mm -hmm. I've, my heart is gonna die or what? Oh, you do, you do feel oh, that? Yeah. That's, that would be, that would no. be a problem. You, you have that these would moments? be a problem if yeah, you don't feel that. No, <laughs> of course not, but of course, uh, sometimes I'm <coughs> under pressure, but <coughs> when, uh, but this is really rare moment. Okay. M most of the time I have no pressure. That's interesting. Um, you guys, as a team, you, <laughs> you have kind of this unique position where you have 
And I, I want to say old, it's obviously not meant in any bad way, but you have people who've had success in the past few years and you have the new, the, the new generation, yeah. people refer to you as a, a generational talent. Um, what strikes you as being the biggest difference? Let's say from the winners of yesterday, the winners of today, what, what is the biggest difference? It's feeling the game, seeing the game, thinking about the game. What's the biggest difference? I think um, that, first of all, uh, it's the right mix. Having old guys, old players with uh, experience and young guys together. Okay. I think it's necessary. I think either uh, having old guys or either having uh, young guys shouldn't work. So first of all, I think that the new generation is more, more based on the individual. They're really good individually. They know how to click. They know yeah. how to... I just feel like that they, they know how to. I just feel to like make the people when are much better than before. Okay. I mean, right now you, you cannot fail or you cannot do mistake or people are gonna fuck you up. <laughs> law, 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 <laughs> law. I mean that's true. I mean I, I just feel like so more skilled. Yeah, yeah people but, are win really more skilled. But the old guys bring like um, the experience, the team play, the the work. I think. Okay. I mean, you can see, I think, like uh, in a team like um, like FaZe, without Carrigan, I'm pretty sure it wouldn't work. I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't work because CS is like pretty that, sure. you know this. Yeah, I'm pretty okay, sure. Okay, say one more time. Okay, uh, <laughs> okay let I'm me finish. Let me finish. I'm sorry. I think I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure, though, but I'm uh, pretty sure. And uh, because, yeah, he's, um, he's bringing s the only thing they don't have and uh, or they have less, you know, being in, in game leader, is um, he's doing the bad work because even now, even though they want something, I see people criticize him and say, mm -hmm. "Oh, yeah, zero dot eighty eight rating." But he's doing too, too many things. And but them. people don't know. I say that people don't know. They have no clue. Yeah. They have no okay. clue of what's going on and what this guy brings to his team. But well, now it's a good opportunity for you to talk about it. Yeah, he is. I, I mean, he's doing. You, you know, I mean. I understand because now I mean I'm trying even more. When I had the French lineup as in game that was different, but now I try to. Okay, on almost no Kevlar, uh, on no pistol I have Kevlar. If we plant the bomb, I drop AK to Zaiwu. He has he dropped me Deagle. Um, if someone saves in the run after he has no money, I give him my AK. Mm -hmm. You make like the salty work all the time, and it's fine. I have no problem with that, and I do it for the team, and I see what Carrigan does as well, and he does exactly that, and you actually need someone doing, you know, the entry fragger word is a big word for me right now. Because when they see people, they're just checking the stats. Okay, on this side, this guy has 30%. He's entry fragging. Like Yekinda. For me, it's not entry fragging what he does. <coughs> He's going to search Jewel all the time. But when you have an execute, it's not going to be all the time the guy running. You know, okay. as, for example, I used to do a lot and but I do now because, yeah. like, doing this salty work, like, Going through a smoke, you know you're gonna die as first. Yeah. And I will. And most of the time, it's for, for this salty work as entry is that, and um, that's a big difference, like uh, between entry fragging and just like looking for duels. It's, I mean, not for me because of course I'm a bit less good than than those guys. But it's easier when you just jiggle and get for, for mm -hmm. to get kills than just running, and you have ten different positions to check. And you have to gamble at some point that, okay, it's not there, let's work on the, only on the left, otherwise I can't. Like. And you have to do that while leading you, the team. You need and someone in your team to do that. You need. Otherwise, it's. Otherwise, no one can do it. Oh, no, exactly. Yeah. You and need then, to get the space uh, for the others. Everyone's going to be like, uh, guys, uh, there's smoke. Uh, uh, then so much on through, then, okay, better go. Uh, everyone. I have everyone the example of no peak, deep up on Mirage. <coughs> How many times the first guy is going to die? 80% of the time. Mm. But imagine that you die, but just a bit further. Yeah, like the guy, it's really the cross annoying. Is, the crosshair is far exactly. away. Exactly, mm. and your friends also already took the space. You die, but then instant two kills. Mm. Of course, in the statistic, it's not shown no, that no. you did that. But you win the round. But you win the round because yeah. you took the space. Mm -hmm. And that's the thing people need to understand. And it's not easy to understand because people don't know. But that's what I see when I see a player like Carrigan. He's making the space on yours. I, I have a funny, uh, I have a small funny story that I heard. <laughs> this morning. Go ahead. Story time. Sure, let's go. Uh, you know. Our friend oh, Lotan, Sphinx. Okay. Sphinx, please. Yeah, yeah yes. no problem. He was, um, he came to me this morning. Oh, we were oh. having breakfast. Ah. And then he said to me that he uh, he saw on statistics that Exile had a really good all pass game yesterday. 
Yeah, so he checked it. So he and <coughs> Spain team really likes to watch demos, and I think he's playing the same position as Axel, yes. both at CTST. Yeah. And then he watched his demo because, I mean, like, he had really good stats. He must have done something like, you know, he must have been playing, doing some really good things and mm. reading the situation correctly. <laughs> and then he says to me, the only two frags he got uh, in full, he only got two frags in full buy runs. The rest was eco and the rest was force buys when they pushed him. I mean, I, I'm not, and obviously I'm not, uh, Excel is a, 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 a fantastic player. No, absolutely, it's not. Absolutely. We're not, we're not. But that's, 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 that's yeah. what I said to him. That is why stats is lying so much sometimes. Because you, you, can, have you can have the craziest game. But Look, you like nuke, no, but nuke, nuke, okay, yeah. nuke. On there are a lot of maps. The echoes goes at the same place all the time. Yeah. Okay, and it's normal. It's, it's not a problem. Is. On dust two, <coughs> people try to go short <coughs> to plant the bomb. On yeah. mirage, they go as a B player. Do I receive in uh, echoes? Mm. Of course not. No. They go mid or A. Yeah. And that's do statistic also. We we underestimate. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay. And I think that. But you know, it's it's. I I, I personally don't care about stats. I think stats has is, has come to a point like also not only in Counter Strike but also like in statistics general. in general it's like it's in, it's life in life is just like yeah. that is the easy thing to look at you know like oh yeah. this guy has been so amazing he's been scored he scored like twenty yeah. goals and but and you know trust statistics is I, always I guess people thing don't you watch the game at. anymore no. they watch the stats exactly. I, I know what you mean um, I'm aware of it and of course stats have to be used carefully Wise when when Wise when you are telling a story I just wonder. You are aware of it as a player, but <coughs> does it still get <coughs> to you? Can it still get to you, right? Or, or not have you reached to a point where, you know what, the tab doesn't matter, zero, <laughs> Me? we're good. Yesterday, Sometimes. zero 11. I remember the 0 0.3 ADR. Zero .3 ADR. Uh, I remember that. <laughs> At 0 07 or 0 06, I understood my <laughs> destiny. <laughs> yeah, he told me what to the scoreboard. <laughs> I remember the chat, I was like, <laughs> he got a kill, I was like, welcome to the scoreboard, bro. <laughs> <laughs> in a like a major match, I will, I will not drop to him any p weapon, but it's fine. It's no, good. but I, 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 I think what you're saying is really good because I think, I think it's normal as, as humans. We like to yeah. be recognized. Sure. We like to look good on the outside. We don't. We like to look good f like from like when others looking at us. Yes. And that is also how it is in Counter Strike. For but sure. so I, I guess when everyone starts the game, they're like, mm, I hope this is gonna be a good yeah. game. You know, I'm gonna get a lot of, of good course. actions and get frags. But well, eventually, if you're in a, in a situation where you don't get that many kills and you <laughs> look at the scoreboard and you have zero <laughs> ten or whatever it is, you're like, Pfft. now it, yeah, I mean, it's too late now in some sense. Okay. I mean, not too late, but you can always do. Uh, obviously, you can always. That's always. I mean, you can find impact. You can find impact. Okay. You win. Maybe you might win the round. Uh, that so the game doesn't go to overtime, and yeah. you're like. Pfft. Well, that, I mean, you guys must probably be way stronger mentally than, than we were or I was back in the years. Because I feel like you if, you had, if you were 0-11 and suddenly you have to get that kill, that's going to make the difference. Mm -hmm. If you are 0-11, it becomes so much harder yeah, to get course. that duel, oh, of course. to get that but one. But yeah, that's why I think nowadays it's, of course, harder to, because you need to be stronger mentally. Okay. Even if, I mean, you see people like tilting sometimes, but the thing is, right after, they go back into the game. Okay. Because they have to. Because otherwise, if you're like bad mentally it's right it's now, it's I think it's over for you. The whole game is over. You don't really yeah. have a choice. You need <coughs> all the players to it's going too fast. on the same page. Dude, it's just too it. fast, exactly. And also, you can focus on somewhere, something else. Yesterday, actually, I'm DM game reader, so it's a bit easier for me to focus on something mm -hmm. else. I try to focus as much as possible on calling. Okay. Calling the best for the team. Just whenever, even though when I was da dead, when I... I was okay. calling as good as possible because I understood my <laughs> destiny <laughs> at that moment. And then, this, without thinking about it, it came back. I okay. came back at like, not, uh, I wasn't like positive, but I think it was 0 11. I finished at 11 20, so it's not that okay. bad. And just, it's important that me, I'm not looking too much at the scoreboard, except this time because it was a bit too much. Okay. But sometime I'm 3 10, and I will be able to do a double because I'm not looking into this because it can get really bad. And if you. If you, you're in a game, you're in an official game, and you realize one of, one of your teammates maybe is going down the drain, how do you, how do you as a team save someone from, from the hell? Like, like you just did with Apex, like laughing about it a little bit. Welcome to the scoreboard, bro. Do you feel sometimes that the team is catching up someone that's actually falling and disappearing? Because we've all been there at a moment where you feel like, you know what, nothing is working. Everyone are I'm not hitting anything. Yeah, I everyone I are different. Uh, I also think it's important that in, in some sense, of course, it's also that the person that's in a situation should always like try as much as possible to to stay positive and, and find 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 their groove. But it's also in some sense, I wouldn't say it's a responsibility, but maybe a little bit yeah, like little from, bit. from the teammates to also say like, 
bro, who the fuck cares? Let's move on, you know. Yep. And you know, it's, it's. I think it's. It, you also need when someone is down and feeling, like, oh, the game's not working. Like you also need the, like the help from the teammates to just tell you, oh, who cares? It's just statistics or whatever the hell. Just yep. fucking keep going. And I mean. I've been have I've have I don't know if I've been playing the game for multiple years. You know I've had slums. I probably have like five or six slums throughout my career. I have one right now. That's what it is. I mean, it, the first thing when you're in a slum is like you just need to accept it. Mm -hmm. Eventually, it's gonna turn around, and you just need to accept it. I mean, like as long as you are doing your best, and no one ex is is expecting more of you. Well, Obviously, if you're in in a slum, you're not not working to get out of it, or at least trying to improve or figure out what is wrong. Yeah. Then sure, you're not maybe not doing the right thing, but you always need to just accept that. Right now, I'm just not. I'm just not uh, feeling it yeah. the same way as I was maybe like half a year ago, and that's just how counter strike is sometimes. Fair enough. Maybe not for this guy, but at least for the 99 percent of the rest of the players. Yes, of course. Sometimes I have a bad game, and yeah, I then don't you feel have it. 120 rating, so it's fine. No. <laughs> I'm yeah, kidding. but you know, no. the, the fun part is I think also <laughs> Zaiwu. Also Zaiwu had a uh, uh, struggling uh, at the, the beginning of yeah. the beginning of the year was by was your standards yeah. lower mm -hmm. than what we used to. Yeah, I mean, I was just. Didn't fit it. I mean, I was just playing and get get wrecked by anyone. I mean, yeah, I can play against my mom. Uh, I think she she can beat me. Oh, that's fine. You step up. No, but you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can step up. And, and I really think that is what a lot like and, uh, a lot of people they go into panic mode when, okay. when they when they hit the slump. And, you know, sometimes and sometimes you just like you need to reset and say like. Yeah. And yeah, it's fine. I mean, it's just a bad moment. Yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, everyone. Sometimes you can think about like football player Messi, Ronaldo. Sometimes they have bad moments in, in their life, and they just come back stronger. They're just gonna try exactly. practice, uh, work hard. I know someone said uh, he said uh, we'll come back stronger. MSL. <laughs> <laughs> He's out there. I don't know why we managed to put an MSL reference in this podcast. No. That's, that's pretty good. I don't one. know. <laughs> but that's, that's that's how this was long. Like you don't really know if it's gonna take one month. It might take three oh, months. Okay. Yeah, you yeah. don't really know. But we got something guys. I'm wow, sorry. Something's working out. Uh, 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 uh. I but keep yeah, like it's all about keep like trying to yeah, just keep working yeah, on it. it. Eventually, okay. it'll we turn around. Do you think people have gotten better at handling this over the years? Because I mean, you guys been here for about 57 years now. Do you think we've gotten better at handling this mm. than it was in the past? Maybe, but I feel we we used to full tilt. As yeah, in but I'm off the planet. I could be kind of worried in uh, in some sense because we'll, I think we're seeing like a lot of new players and young players coming into the game. Maybe they haven't tried having a slump before because you know all of a sudden there's a lot more coming into the game, a lot more pressure and all stuff. And all of a sudden they find themselves as like kind of true professionals. Mm -hmm. And I think it's the way they handle it. I mean, I, I think they could go like we did back in this. We could go like full panic mode when things were not working out. Ah, I just need to play more deathmatch. I just need to play yeah. a lot more. I need to watch uh, ten demos a day. But sometimes it's just sometimes in your, yeah, in your brain. It's just mental and yeah. actually wanting it too much. Take this from a very, very veteran player, or whatever. Like if wanting it too much, sometimes no, chasing no. it too much will only make you, like, will only increase the distance. Nice, please. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. But obviously, you need to still work for it. But it shouldn't be like ten thousand deathmatch French today because you know, that's not going to help. You know, I, I was thinking about that when I saw like Bit his first year, 2021, destroying everyone, aimwise being like. So good. Probably the best aimwise. Yep. Whenever you face him, it was like, uh, oh. yeah, he was like, oh, yeah. Yeah. Like <laughs> and I was it's like, true. okay, this this young guy has, should, when we he will have a slump, because, <laughs> and of course, he doesn't have a slump right now, but he's a bit less good. And sometimes he pops up, but not as much as he did, because it's tough, because it's really tough, and and yeah, it's not easy to to come back from that. I don't get me wrong, huh? the guy is a machine. Huh? Mm. Yeah, of course. He's, oh. not, he's not playing bad at all. Can you fix this one? He's Put just not. It's like oh, when you fine. see was simple playing like worse, you're like, it's just not in the standard. Mm. It's not what we used to used see. Used to see. I understand. But sometimes it's so it is. happened. I mean. Boys, look at that. We, are, we finish? We are not, we uh, we are not robots. Him? I just have to say, probably so far, I have found three pieces. I'm so you guys are doing, you're basically 4v5 on that one, or 3v4 <laughs> or whatever, because I'm. I've, I've found we three used pieces. to be like this. Uh, <laughs> we're thinking. <laughs> we're thinking. You're I, don't know. <laughs> I don't know who's the guy. But <laughs> <laughs> hope it's not me. <laughs> <laughs> this one oh. should be. This yeah. one should be. I was. I was hoping. Yeah. Why is that? This was this a part of a wing. Could that work? No, it yeah, doesn't. Yeah, could that work? But this one. No, we don't. Maybe now. Focus uh, on the puzzle. You want to focus on the puzzle? <laughs> oh, we can do both. <laughs> yeah, no, we, we can do both. both. We can do both. Law. Ah. Actually, now if we. We go down memory lane as well. 
The majors have come such a long oh, way. Lo, lo, lo. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's good, good no? Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's good. So, Mina, you can find this for me. I, that's going to be my goal. Yeah. <laughs> but that's going to be my only goal for the rest of this segment. Um, it. I just thoughts on the stage in Challenger, because that's something that's brand new, and uh, at yes, least yes. we have zero experience with that. And we used to be playing in the studio. Hell, we used to be playing in the gymnasium of Katowice. Yeah, <laughs> back in the days, in these squares. You play where? We, we used to be playing in like a, a gymnase. Oh, and like, ah. a, like, a gym, like a gym hall, right? <laughs> for and majors. We were, for a major, and we had the square, and all, everybody was kind of looking at each other, and you had the eight teams here playing. I, I cannot remember, like, a small video when Pasha opened a knife and everyone yeah, that's like exactly it. Yeah, that's, I there. that's there. That's, that's exactly there. I was there. I was sitting And it was like, we everyone were was right close to each other. You can see, like, you can play. Next to each other. Actually, it was good to see, like, you can go, like, behind the Virtus Pro or behind the SK and just watch uh, people playing. I, actually, before, I loved it. You were playing with, was it Dignitas at the time, Pierre? Was it TSM uh, Dignitas? Or Copenhagen Wolf? No. Dignitas, Dignitas. Dignitas, probably. Dignitas. Are you sure? 2014. This one in 2014-15. That was, that, was, no, that was 14, yeah. The one, no, the one you mentioned was 14. TSM, 15. Sure? 15 TSM and 16 uh, question mark. You know, mark as you know, oh, I know it. Life you know you it. <laughs> you can trust my memory, bro. <laughs> 2014 Dinitas and 15 TSM and 2016 as Oh, lolo, this guy. See, he's done his research. Yeah, he's... Uh, I mean, you, you, know, you know the guy, research, no? you know the kind of memory. Master, research I hold here, man. Isn't this research all, is in my brain. This is all of my stuff, isn't it? Yes, I think so. It's definitely. Yeah, it, it would have been fo too. funny if it was actually all of us. Is it? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah. Uh, right. No. Hey, 2014. This, this, Can you this get a bit and now you're actually playing the Challenger stage in front of thousands of people. It's really cool. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. cool. When they, they said it, I was like so... And I was even more like happy to, to be able to play uh, against the Brazilian team. Because I knew the crowd would be against us. How was the experience? So funny. Uh, for me, at least. Yeah. Actually, I love actually, it. I, like, yeah, I, it nice. I mean, just to play in front of the crowd. I mean, I don't care to, to have the crowd against me or with me. It's just so oh, funny. You found it. <sighs> yeah, Good job. Sorry. The the for, find everything. for me, just why not? God, it's to play in front of the crowd. Yeah? I mean, yeah. I, I like it. What's that? You guys see yourself as a crowd stage type of team? It's part Better of on the stage? Like oh, I yeah, think so. I think so. I think I think why not? We are more excited yeah. to oh, play in front of Crown Club, no? Yeah, so he has to be in a backstage. So and just what, according to you, what makes, what defines a team that's better on the stage? Because we always say, oh yeah, that team, oh they're gonna be on the stage now, for sure they're gonna play better Counter Strike. Yeah. Crowd what, what is about a team <laughs> that's better on the stage? <laughs> cool. uh, I think I can say like more experienced team, like kind of phase, navy. Uh, people that get used, at yeah, least. get used. Phase Navy, Liquid. This kind of team, okay, I think uh, they are better on stage than okay. like playing mm -hmm. in studio. Or okay, it's harder to beat them on because stage. Because I think like they also like to play in front of count. It's try hard mode. Now yeah, like that's this is try hard. Now that, <laughs> get, that gets me to my next question because it's actually a debate that <coughs> we're, we're usually having on the desk. For example, okay. they are they are players. They show up at the major and they have a great tournament from the get-go. Let's, I don't know, Xertion, for example, for Maus, absolute, just fusé, a rocket from the very beginning. <laughs> um, but some players, of course, seem to be impacted by, by the stage. Do you, do you think that from the very beginning you can see if a player is going to be good or there should be a time given and people can change and you can people up can or... Change for sure. People can change, I mean... I know, uh, that's for sure. I, re I mean, you know, for example, the first stage uh, um, uh, Zaiwu did, I don't what? feel it was that good. It was in China. Or Star Yeah, Star yeah, yeah. It wasn't yeah. that good, but it was normal. I was like, okay, I'm not afraid. And the second one was ECS, and we won ECS in front, okay. and he was in PP. So, so two stages was enough? Uh, for him, yes. And then we did Kolong final, he we did MVP as well. Uh, for me, 15 you need K to, people, to wait like for three or four tournaments in front of stage to, to see if he's going to be good. or Because one or two, I mean, for me, it's not enough. Okay. But it's still like a relatively limited sample, right? Yeah. Three or four events. It's it's good. And you already have it. So it's almost you you either have it or you don't. If yeah. after three or four tournaments you've already found your groove. I think it's dependent also for the person. I mean how he's gonna handle everything. Under the pressure or how he's gonna feel. Also if he's gonna see all about Twitter, if he's gonna do bad matches on scene or I mean, depends of everything I think. Okay. Because sometimes I think 
Of course, nice this one is good. Oh, oh this is a so maniac. <laughs> maniac. <laughs> there we go. I keep my mom. I mean, and my song. <laughs> we need to find. This is a rondel. No. No, no, no it's not that one. What is this? Yeah, no. I'm sorry, but I'm not. This one was even too. I think even I can say it's that. It's fine. This was against me, so I'm allowed to be. To uh, mess find this, this one up. Find this. Okay, Daddy. You were the one that had to suffer this moment. Yes. Mamma mia. Well, we need to find his I face. Was, I was in Tignitas. I remember that. That was horrible. Didn't it us? When? When? When all of Master did this against us. It was against me. Yeah. Semi final. And we were in the other semi final with me. It was in quarterfinals. You, you were in semi. You lost this semi. He did the what? You lost. He defusing the molly in 14 14. Ah, yeah. yeah. What a dog. And lost, we lost to NIP. Was that? Oh, that was Cologne then. Yeah. 2014, oh. exactly. I still remember Get Right Kill Me 70 million times and drop on Cobblestone. Remember they had this tower, they had the two level yeah, tower. Yeah. So Cobblestone already, but in the time it was not just a drop. You could go up top, you could go down. Yeah, the, it yeah. was really weird. Completely lost. And also like, uh, you know, on A, you could have, uh, you know, the old, like, I don't know. Ah, you can, in mid, you can yeah, go, you the could top. go Oh yeah, you could yeah, go yeah, top, yeah, exactly. You could you go, go in the tower. Yeah, was I was so playing A, it was really fun. <laughs> <laughs> I remember this. Do you sometimes I, watch I don't these? Uh, I don't know why I remember yes, this. Yes, I do. I Me, I do. Remember uh, some action of Epsilon? I don't know who did that. I think Foxio did. Foxio killed the uh, kills. forest. Yeah, he yeah, knifed yeah. off Florent. Yeah, yeah. He knifed I him. Yeah. I remember he went down the ladder and knifed yeah, him. Exactly. It's because Epsilon beat I remember NAP just for in group stage in this tournament. Do you, so you say you, you rewatch these sometimes? Yeah, these sometimes they can yeah. see me watching like 2015 games, 17, 18, uh, 13. But sometimes we, we like to play some quiz. Okay. And sometimes we just ah oh, in this tournament he said did that or yeah. we just love to to remind uh, what happened in this tournament oh, oh. you find no ah, uh, no. No. Ah, yes. ah yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. yeah, yeah oh. actually actually it actually, is good. actually, actually it works no yeah, this, yes. yeah, I think this one should be kind of should be possible to find it oh, no, oh Maniac second one oh, I'm so proud now of I'm, you. I'm on I'm on the streak now yeah. Yeah. what do you what do you think of the level when you rewatch because I do the same sometimes I watch I feel like we 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 didn't even know how to play. We we was but was that's, it was easy that's to why read. CS grows so much. But you know, also in 2000, I mean, the level is way different than when they were like the best team in the world. In 2018, 19, people were way worse than right now. That's for sure. When we're watching the games, when we're watching the games, for example, Denyuk, Denyuk. Back then, they were like a crazy win streak. Who? You. you. Ah. But they did ah. the same all the time? Of course. Glaive was going secret. Three follow B, Jupri silo, doing the same all the time. But that's why it was because no one was anti training at Yeah, exactly. We and just anti train and we're like, ah, we see this, ah, they're doing this smoke, but not that smoke. Now, nah, okay, they're gonna go three ramp. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that's the you key. Also, yeah, th that's funny with anti strat because there were this moment as well that you don't have anymore. Sometimes you could see a pattern that people, when they did this smoke line, it was to do that. Yeah, that's now, not the case now. Now no. they do one one line Sometimes of smoke. Rare. They can do four thing. Yeah, yeah I mean, at least four. Yeah, at least. Or they're gonna do like. <laughs> it's too many things to. So, but before that was exactly like that, and okay. that was really funny. I'm sorry to interrupt, but can someone find all of Master's nose? <laughs> <laughs> Where's the nose? I don't know. Yeah, I've, tried, I've been looking for his nose for a long time now. Ah! Ah! You just have to ask. Ah. You just have to ask. No. He had it right as there. As game leader. Nice. He had it right there. We're getting better, guys. I hope you have like. It's okay. Minutes. They have about five hours. Everyone is going to stay on set for ah, about five hours. Okay. We're good. <laughs> we're just oh going to oh speed, oh speed run the end. And we're gonna make it look like we were super fast. Yeah, yeah. Was, no, was look, look, it's getting We're gonna get there. Uh, this, is, this has to be. Fucking go, boys! Focus! This one is. Full focus, fast. We're entering the Direct. absolute rush hour right it should now. Be, it should be easier now because we have less and less. No, that doesn't mm. work. But I cannot see oh, with wait. Peter. Uh, wait, look, look, Peter. On the <laughs> table. Peter's <laughs> on the table. Move. Peter, can you just move a little bit? Yeah. Just, <laughs> just to see? Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah thank you. <laughs> oh, I was hiding. Yeah! You're hiding again? The fuck, Peter? <laughs> ah, yeah, right. That yeah. actually helps a little bit. Okay. So there's more wing here. We, we should finish like what thing? Yeah. This one is. Uh, this white this is ear. Uh, it's ear oh. as well. That one must, uh, that hey, must move, be around move. here. Well, no. I thought. <laughs> no. no Peter, That's why when it doesn't fit, just fucking slam. This yeah, surely, it's this up there. No. Yes. Surely this has Where? to be over here. Come down, come down, come down, come down, baby. Can we nice. have something oh here? There we go. Oh, 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 now we got something going on. I think we have. And they. No, no, no. Wait. No, no. That's too small. It's not going to work. That's what she says. <laughs> there so we go. No. We got it. That's that's in it. It's never gonna go away from the camera. <laughs> you know that's the thing when you work on camera. Whatever you say stays forever. It's <laughs> oh. I know. I know that, and it's fun. <laughs> I will oh, show that to my kids. We got something a kid. going. I will. No. Oh, it gets faster. There Look at that, guys. We're gonna finish it's this. It's fucking go, boys. I think we're on the run. Come no. Come no, Come no. There we go. Yeah, how's how's your Danish now? You're working. Uh, it's really good. 
Yeah, I think, I, think, uh, I, think, I, think I, I know more friends than they know. Yeah, of course. Sure. I mean, yeah. before joining Variety, you know, like, kind of how you to speak French. French mm -hmm. But you, you have a lot Me? of words. Yeah, yeah, you have a lot of words. No. Yes. Yeah, but I don't know. How I, know but I, I know a lot of, of words, but I'm having a hard time. Sentence. I have a hard time putting a sentence. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course, it's really hard. But but I'm trying. Can you sometimes. step up then? <laughs> Do you guys ever uh, maybe use say a sentence in French? <laughs> you ever use your own language in a game anymore? <laughs> yes, it happens. We do sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes. we have some French things. Okay, so we have. A, I, I will say a little story. Oh, we have story a, time. With a jo Spinks joining the team. Oh. Okay, we have a, a name fun. called put. It means war. War in English, okay? And we had that oh, uh, for a long time. Sure. Yeah, bitch. And, um, and we have put and pit. So we yeah, said, Molly put. And he understood Molly pit. <laughs> and we were like, what are you Wait, we him for 15 seconds because for the Molly. Because, we, because we kind of knew he was put. Yeah, and he didn't Molly. And he was in, uh, like in the blast yeah. tournament. <laughs> and we lost the round because of that. And he said, oh, guys, I don't know what's put. Uh, he said put. <laughs> was so and funny. we were like, okay. I don't even know if it, I, I hope we can use that segue over. I think it's okay. It's not, it's not too bad of a word anyway. Right? No, I mean, you know, it's no, a common word. Okay. <laughs> it's a common word. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a spot on. Spot nice. on. Spot. Wait. Spot. Okay, we, we, got, it, some, we got it going on here. Stop. Ow. Stop it. Sure this this sure. one should be easy to find. Yeah, the that, face. That, yeah, that one the, should be the fine. The face. The face? The face. Oh, yeah, that's the one, that's the one, that's the one, you got it, you got it. Wait. There's flames that's down there. One right? I swear this is... I swear... Pierre, take it this way. We're on the right way, guys. It's Soon your job is over. Well. Thank you very okay. much, everyone. All the pieces for that. Okay, okay. We need the green, yeah. I think they're just going to speed run it towards the end. Oh, it's going to be easy. No, but no, I think it's going to get easier. Green, yeah, what is your problem? There must be around here. There's no way. Green, green, what is your problem? Wait. Oh, we got it. Let's go, boom. There's only one missing here. I think Shred, that's that must be an obvious one. <laughs> Just <laughs> don't be done for once. Okay. Is that I the one? Nice guys, look, look. Oh, here. we got it. Oh, it oh la la, it's, it gets it's coming. Oh. This one should oh. be. This one should be easy. Oh. Boom. Oh, my oh God. La, we're going. Uh, okay. Okay, we're going. That's the one. Nope. I think maybe I should get the final piece. <laughs> we're, I don't think it would be fitting. I didn't help anything. I was put a couple right. of puzzles here and there. Oh, this one. I know where this one goes. No, oh, keep it. Right. This one, yeah. yeah. No, it's not this one. You sure? Yeah, we need three. Ah, uh, sure. One we need one with three dicks, sorry. <laughs> this one. Yeah, with three? That's a two, that's one this here. One. Uh, I have one, but... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, one. This one. Mm -hmm. So we need one with two. This, no. Yeah, maybe. This one. Wait. Nice, yeah. boy. Nice, Matthews. So nice, Matthews. Oh, also, oh, Zaiwood doesn't... Uh, Spinks doesn't know to say Matthew. He say nice, Matthews. Nice, Matthews. Matthews. <laughs> because <laughs> everyone <laughs> call, call me Matthew. Wait. Because we have three Matthew in the team. Yeah. So everyone uh, has... Oh, yeah. You have Matt one, well. one Matt. Yeah. Uh, manager is special because we, this is is, uh, Olympic we don't have another <laughs> word to say, Matt. <laughs> and me is So he's saying, Mateus. nice, Mateus. So you are... Mateus, he's Mateus. You are Mateus. No, so pro guys, that, that before mm -hmm. stopping, before that finishing, so proud of you guys. Yeah. For what we did together. Uh, it was a really team, real team... Uh, that was a team effort. Effort, yeah. I was dropping weapons. We need this one, please. You have everything in your hands. Uh, where, where's the one with the... We need one with like a... You have... I have it. Uh, yeah. That one's the funniest. No, but no. this one makes sense because there has yeah. some you white see, on this yeah. one. The, the white? One? Yeah, I have it. No, I have it. Yeah, yeah. pass it. Oh, that's the one. White. Yeah. That's the one. Uh, the white dick. <coughs> Sorry. All right. Yeah, then. I have some fire. All right, gentlemen. So I think it's maybe there. That's oh, that's the one. Boom. The rest is fine. No, 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 no. Should be a bit blue. Yes. No. Blue here, no. Yes. No. Blue here. That's that's dark blue here. Have some dark blue. Oh. No. I just take thirty seconds break while they're finishing it. I feel like I've been working really hard in this segment. <laughs> We're nearing the end. Ah, of course, the joys of editing. This one? Uh, it's tough this? because I can't see with your hands. Put Maybe your this? Hands uh, no, no, it's not. This one? It does look like it, but no. Yeah, it does. No, but I found No, it's not. Ah. Wait. What could that be? Wait, this? Maybe this? This one? Yeah. This? Oh, oh that's yeah. the one, that's the one. What would this weird. I'm gonna finish. Where's this one go? I actually don't know. I'm gonna wait. We do it together. Did you, uh, yeah, it's good. Do you last one together? Imagine if we miss a piece. <laughs> yeah, no, we, do, we do not. Are you sure? We have yeah. all there. We have, we have three. all. Oh, yeah, okay. Have Take four one. different pieces. Okay, no, this one is mine. Okay. So okay. You can go. Go ahead. Uh, I'll let you guys finish it. Wait. This one has to be like that more. Oh, I was you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. 
There we go. Let's go! Come on, Kuro. Where is it? Easy. Uh, uh, only took us. Easy, I'm not How sure. How many? It's like 200 maybe? 200, yeah. Oh, I feel exhausted. Maybe we did 100? 50? Well, guys, it's been a pleasure to do this puzzle with Apex, with Dupree, with Zaiwu. They told me a lot about the game, more about the puzzles. I'm feeling ready for the next one. Just kidding, I hope <laughs> I never have to do any puzzle ever in my life. But I had a really good time, I hope you had too. And we'll see you around in Rio. Salut. Salut. Salut, Tubis.